you know, my background really, I started with, uh, you know, electric propulsion, went to batteries, went from batteries to lithium to help develop a major uh, lithium asset, finished that development, brought it to home, you know, uh, stayed with it until it became a significant producer, retired, began to look, and then ended up being very fortunate to find what I think is really uh, the next great piece of production in, in the world. You know, I believe that uh, Global Geosciences Rhyolite Ridge is going to be a very important uh, resource because the fundamentals of the rocks and the nature of the chemistry of those rocks and how they can be processed allows us to make straightforward processing routes and be able, we believe, to be able to be produced uh, at a, on a cost basis that makes us very competitive in the industry. You know, in the long term, the beauty of this asset is it's, it's uh, large, uh, it, the cost to mine it is going to be low during a long period of production. It's big so it, it supports long-term economic production. The chemistry is excellent and allows us to have a very straightforward process flow sheet that ultimately produces two excellent products that are in need, lithium and boron both of them being produced, we think, on a competitive cost basis. It, it's easy to understand how Rhyolite Ridge could have been missed by many people because it was grouped with others that had mainly clay deposits. And removing the lithium from the clays proved to be extraordinarily difficult and expensive. But it's very critical to understand that this is not a clay project. It is actually a very interesting boron lithium project which allows us to be able to be economic. And this, is, this was the hidden jewel that made this so valuable.